We've talked a lot about is what's been called the tamale bill and a lot of people are very excited that it is now officially tamale time. After vetoing something similar last year, Governor Katie Hobbs signed off on a new law this year that expands what food can be legally sold after being made at home and this goes beyond baked goods. There are stipulations, but now you can sell products with meat that you prepare in your personal kitchen. And listen up, Swifties, two bills dubbed the Taylor Swift Act are now the law of the land, which aim to crack down on ticket resellers and bots. Now, this comes after Ticketmaster's website crashed back in 2022 when fans were trying to buy tickets for her Eras tour. Bots can no longer buy tickets in bulk or use multiple emails and IP addresses to get around security measures. And resellers are prohibited from selling multiple copies of one ticket, reselling tickets before they are publicly available, and not disclosing seat locations ahead of purchase. And there's no foul play for Arizona homeowners looking to raise chickens. Now you can have up to six chickens in your backyard without fear the local government will step in. But no roosters are allowed. And there are some rules and regulations like how close the coop can be to homes and neighbor buy-in is needed depending on where you live. I spoke with one former chicken owner in Scottsdale who's happy more neighborhoods will be able to experience the farm animals. I think it's such a great thing. Like we hatched our chickens from eggs. Um, they became part of our family. They were just so nice. And um, we enjoyed having the fresh, fresh eggs and, and we shared it with our neighbors and, and we kept them kind of quiet and clean. And, and so it was, it was a nice experience. I think it's a good thing that more people have the option to have this. And another interesting one, you don't need a driver's license to ride off-highway vehicles, but a different law requires teens to wear a helmet when using them to avoid a fine. And I think there might be another one where a parent could be penalized if their kid is not wearing a helmet on I, one of those. I think that's a, that's a smart thing. We've seen quite a few crashes in the area. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of kids involved sometimes in those too. So yeah. the big question, are, are both of you ready to get chickens now and, and have your own eggs? <laughs> I have an apartment and I don't <laughs> think I can have chickens. It there. might be tough, but that um, former owner that I spoke with did kind of make it sound like a, a pretty fun thing. So maybe someday when I have more space. Fresh eggs. Absolutely. Yeah. Be nice for breakfast. And an alarm clock. Yes. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> a hatch alarm. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Michaela.